Hello and welcome to a quick tutorial video for the image scraper module inside SEO Content Machine Next. You can find the tool on the left hand side here, Scrape Images. It's very simple. You just type in the keyword of the image you want to find. So let's try cat and click search. And it's going to go away and do its thing. So now it's found a whole bunch of images which is going to download and allow you to preview. So your options are here. You can click on an image that you want to download. Once you've clicked on your image, you can clear your selection by clicking on this button here, clear selection. You can also select all the images available by clicking on the select all. You notice that there is a number for each of these buttons here which show you how many images you have selected. So I'm going to clear my selection and just select one image. Now the first button here says copy data URL. So what it's going to do, it's going to actually take this image and download it and save it as an image embed or if you know base64 data URL the easiest way to demonstrate what this means is if I copy on this and I go to preview article and I click paste you see a whole bunch of what looks like nonsense characters but it starts with data image base so if I went and did this so image then we go space source equals and then close it you notice that the image actually appears here. Instead of downloading images normally through a URL, which means a hotlinked image to another website or another service, instead the image is now saved and embedded locally into your article. Going back to scrape images, similarly if we select an image again, we can click on copy image and if I go back to the preview article and paste it, uh, we get just the URL of the original image, so you might prefer to use your images this way and finally we have save image so if I click and click on save image it's going to go to my hard drive and allow me to save this locally uh, for me to use elsewhere now if I take you to the create article module and click on a new article creator when we go to the content inserts if you look here there's an insert image content inserter and if we click on select own images because and we want to filter and accept only the most relevant images for our articles we can actually click on the custom image URLs and so this is where we'll paste our image URLs if we had any however if I click on scrape images it's, so it's actually going to open that image scraping tool again so within the article creator you have access to this tool from the click of a button so like before all I have to do is click on the images I want to use and if I want to have hot linked images I can click on copy image URL if I want my images to be embedded in our article I click on copy data URL and I close this form and I paste it in so it's going to take a couple seconds to save so now our images are saved as custom image URLs now when we go on to create our article the images will appear within our article as an embed now the only downside to having sort of these data image URLs is that the size of your Articles are going to go up to many kilobytes in size. That's obviously because you're saving an image inside that article. If you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comment section of the video below. You can always get in contact with me at any time. Email info at seocontentmachine.com.